I am so sorry, Charlie. Oh, thank you, Brody. You were so, uh, you were so great when Jessica lost Chloe. If there's anything I can do for you. No, I think between AA and Vicky, I'm, uh, I'm getting by, so. You know, Jared once told me how much he liked the fact that I brought in flowers from my garden. Hmm. Yeah, I told him that. Uh, maybe I'd give it a try. Got our own place. Look, Grandma. What is that? A turkey? Gobble, gobble. <laughs> a turkey? Oh, my God, it's Thanksgiving. I completely forgot. But don't worry about it. It's just a meal. But it completely slipped my mind. I can't believe this. Excuse me. Happy Thanksgiving. Uh, we thought maybe you could use some help with Thanksgiving dinner if we're not intruding. Intruding? You are the answer to my prayers. Oh my God, come in. Hi, baby. Happy Thanksgiving. Oh, Mom. Hey. Hi, Shane. Jeez. Hi, Max. Mr. Fantos. I'm not alone. Oh. Oh. Yeah, the stuffing really isn't that bad. Uh, I hate to break it to you, but that's the turkey. <laughs> Wouldn't mom and dad have called by now? Who needs a lousy phone call? Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> Mom, Dad, are you really? Oh, it's sweet. Yeah, and we brought company too. Here. Hello, Gregory. Dad, that gas will come out. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> It's not like my mom used to make. Very interesting looking. Well, green beans is green beans. Sure you don't want to come? Yeah, I'm sure. I'm cool. Just a couple hours till Black Friday. You know, uh... My, my mother was far from perfect, but, uh... She loved me. And I always knew that. Sounds like she was a pretty good mom. She was. You remind me a lot of her. If you change your mind. Thanks. Hey, got any carbs? What are you trying to say? Nothing. I'm just really glad that Kyle's bringing the green bean casserole. Is this finally going to be your first date? Uh, we're saving that. Hey, what about you? You know what? I've never been on a date with Chris. He's never even asked. Well, I moved back in. Isn't that enough? No. no. Oh. Uh, I got it. Happy Thanksgiving, Oliver. Happy Thanksgiving. How you doing? Well, if all those years with Roxy didn't teach you to hang tough, nothing will. That's not the only good thing that Roxy gave me. A deep appreciation for leopard print? You never blinked an eye when I asked you to help me find Jared, and I'm never going to forget that. Say that when you see my bill. I'm serious. You're the best brother that anyone could ever ask for. So I guess Gigi's not mad at you anymore for running off with me. Yeah, we're great. Did he get Stacy and her friend to keep their trap shut? Yeah. And I don't know how he did it. Well, he probably told them there was nothing to be gained. I mean, all you did was sleep at Skylar's place one night. I mean, nothing happened between you two. Yeah, I know. And, um... 
It's just the last thing Rex needs right now. Jared was awesome. He totally let me beat him in Z-Box last year. He did, huh? <laughs> well, he wouldn't admit it, but I knew he did. I'm really sorry. Oh, thank you, Shane. You ought to go check out the games they got here, huh? Really? Yeah. Well, don't break anything. <laughs> That's a good kid you got there. Yours wasn't so bad either. I agree. So, how's your mom? Roxy, up to her same old tricks. <laughs> She's something. I still can't believe she talked me into pretending that I was your dad. I was proud to be your son. Jared was too. Happy Thanksgiving. Yeah. That might be wishful thinking, but uh, I'm very grateful that we can all be together today. And I agree. Come in, please. Well, there are my girls. Oh, I'm so glad you're here, Dad. Me too. Hi, Dad. Hi. Where is Nora? Where she should be. And so am I. Oh, my word. Is it cherries in this stuffing? Your mother is a good cook. Ooh. Totally. How are you doing, son? Okay. So you heard I can't feel anything yet, right? Yeah. I'm sorry. This is not happening as soon as you wanted it to, sweetie. It's okay. Waiting. Now that you're here. I hope things get better for Greg now that his family's here. Me too. Why'd they even bother to come? They wanted to see you. Yeah. Could have fooled me. Look, when Clint Buchanan offered to fly us out here, I said we should do it. I figured that if we were all together... That's not your fault, Pop. It's not your fault either, son. Yeah, it is. And I'm sorry. I don't know where things are headed with Rachel and I, but I'm gonna keep pursuing it, whether Mom and Sean like it or not. Vicki, you must feel as if you have the weight of the world on your shoulders. I've been better. No worries. I wasn't expecting you to congratulate me. I'm sorry, on what? Your marriage to Amelia Bennett? No. <laughs> the city council asked me to take over as mayor. I assumed that you knew. No, I, I didn't know. I've been avoiding the telephone. Let me be the first to announce that, to you that after careful consideration, I decided to say yes. As well you should. Heartiest congratulations, Dorian. <laughs> You actually sound as if you mean that. I do. I think you could be an excellent mayor. If you choose to. I'll bear that in mind. I'm glad to hear it. Happy Thanksgiving, Vicky. Happy Thanksgiving, Dorian. <laughs>